So, you just got yourself an Ozobot and you need to learn how to start using it. The very first um, thing that you'll need to learn is how to calibrate your Ozobot, which means that your Ozobot will be able to read any of the lines um, on a piece of paper accurately. So, Ozobot has one button and one button only. When you want to calibrate your Ozobot, you need to press and hold until he starts to flash white and you place him under the calibration spot. Flashing. He'll move forward, flash a little bit blue, flash green, and then turn off. That is a successful calibration of my Ozobot on that paper um, dot. Now, in my classroom, I actually have dots pre-done, little stickers on the back of our placemats in the middle of our table. It works exactly the same way. Press and hold, let him start to flash, put him on the dot, and wait till he moves forward and starts to flash. Now, if you put a Nozobot on a dot and you haven't pressed and hold correctly, he will just start running around kind of crazy and turning in circles, just like you can see there. What he's doing is he's following the edge of that circle. He's definitely not calibrating. He's just following what he thinks he sees. Same thing can happen on the edge of these dots here. So you have to be really careful. You have to make sure that you've gotten your Ozobot to the part where it flashes, and you have to make sure that the sensors, which is this part here with the five little holes in the bottom there, are where the uh, black area is. So press and hold, let him start to flash, put him on the spot. And there you have it, a calibrated Ozobot ready to run.